I respect your feelings, Karen. It's, it's kind of spilled milk, so sorry. Could you have told him to come I tomorrow? He surprised me, and I'm welcoming that surprise. So, so he wanted to come and stay with seven women? Ray would not appreciate it. All of you are leaving. Still talking about Nola. I was told from this girl and from Robin that you had issue with me. I was told that in Nola, you're in the lobby saying, "Well, why is she on Instagram?" Who told you that? Everybody came back and told me. I was with Katie. And Katie, you, is that what, what happened? I'm, I saw you on Instagram live. Okay, you were and in that's, bed. And I have a right to do that. Do whatever I, you want. And I did, but be quiet there. I was saying thank you to the people who had wished me condolences that's for my not, parents. That's not what I heard. South Africa. Oh, we love her. Oh. They said I love my hair. I just felt like you were lying. Let us not ignore the timing. Was very close to me burying my father. Yeah, everybody knows that. I can do what I want. I bowed out to thank the people on in Instagram, and I will do it again. But you can understand why she'd be upset. Hell no. She's a phony. She but set that up, and then she lent. What's the? What's that? It's, excuse me, then Ashley. She knew at that time that I had lost my parents. This has nothing she, to yes, do with it does. that. Don't no, you it tell me it doesn't. Care. It, it doesn't matter. 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 It
We so all know that. No, we don't know that. Yes. We don't know Anytime that. Anytime Ray's around and Erica, he Erica. leaves you in the dust. Oh, honey, oh my God. So that he can oh be my God. Right I've never been Erica. left in the dust. Are they in there arguing? It oh looks no, that way. I, I see Karen's hands moving swiftly. Yes, you have a really problem. Now Sherman's going. No, I got Erica. Not you only got him because Erica you. don't want Erica. him. Okay. This is getting old. Giselle needs to be less worried about my husband and more concerned about getting one. In particular, stop dating other people's leftovers. Erica okay. is a very happily married woman. Yes. Can you understand that? Yes, she and is. So are Ray and, and Ray I. So this is wants to lick her. This up is what we're down. not gonna do. And can, we, can we not? Bye bye. And we all very in the back. You have a hand. That's why Ray wants Erica Lowe. We'll see you. We will see you. We will see you in the morning. We'll see you. Not the man that owns the house. We'll see you. I'm sad. I'm sad that this happened. But I'm. I want you to understand and respect my feelings. I'm just not comfortable. I respect your feelings, Karen. It, just, it kind of spilled milk, so sorry. Could you have told him to come I, I, to our room? He surprised me, and I'm welcoming that surprise. So he no. wanted to come and stay with seven women? Ray would not appreciate it. All of you are leaving. Two more mornings. Karen and Giselle need to get over this menopausal mood swing, OK? Girl, bye. I'm a married woman. I know he would not be comfortable with me having another man I in the house. Tell her, I just like you're mad because Ray's not coming, maybe. I don't know. Is, is there some hostility because this is a whole estrogen train and I'm not on it? These are married women. We've been walking around in our panties. Michael will go home and stay in the bedroom and not come out the entire time. Or he can go to a hotel. Bye. Y'all can stay in a hotel. You left early. I thought you were going to stay. Since you didn't care. I about mean, you that. are you are my guest uh, still. I didn't say time for you to go home. Oh, right. So I but kept you, that you in mind. You did tell us all you don't care. What I said I don't care about was the fact that this is still my husband's home that we share together, mm -hmm. and he is in no way going to infringe on anyone's space while he is here. There are more people to be concerned about than the people under this roof tonight. I'm sorry, my husband would not approve of this. Michael should not be here. His wife explicitly told Raymond that it's an all-girls weekend. I right. wanted to take the time to invite everyone to come to our beach house in Bethany Beach. Is this a girls only this is thing? girls only. If you have a protrusion in your pants, you're not allowed to come. Mr. Huger would not have shown up. And if he had, he would have rented a hotel and said, baby, join me down here. I'll have you back in the morning so you can have breakfast with your girlfriends. I'm just saying. My thing is like, like, all right, girls, we can over. Michael's yeah. here. Well, it was actually a really nice surprise. Did you expect me to kick my husband oh, out? No. Is that what you're saying? Oh, no. Absolutely not. No, what we're saying is it made absolutely me uncomfortable, not. OK? And I was enjoying the weekend doing our girl bonding thing. And Karen, if Ray had come, would Ray, you Ray have taken Ray, Ray out? Have, Ray wouldn't have come. Ray wouldn't, Ray wouldn't have come. You invited us it's to be together. As you girls. are exaggerating and blowing the situation so far out of proportion. You did not incredible. invite us to be together as girls and then Michael come at the end. That's not what you invited us to. I can't believe they're taking a nice gesture by my husband and turning it to something ugly. Like, what the hell is your deal? You gonna resolve this or not? Because I'm gonna have a drink this is your home, and I'm Michael. gonna have a good time. And Enjoy if you guys yourself. wanna spend time over there, I'll go and spend time somewhere else. But I'm gonna have a good okay. time because that's why I came down. Michael, this is your home. And this is Michael, just this, this is, is drama that I don't even understand. Since we're Uncle. talking about friendships, Giselle. Yes. At last night at dinner, we were talking about Jamal. Karen kind of brought it up. If you were purposely keeping him away from us. No. Him. I think it's the message is getting lost in what my intentions were in asking that question. I want this to okay. be very clear. It was a reach out to you to say, look. We got you. Yes. You know? You didn't say that last night at all. I don't think you received that. Because you, well, you didn't say it last night. No. I'm saying be cautious. That's, be cautious. You That's said what that already. Said. Whether you see him or not. No, no, no. What it's happened not about in the past. Me. It, my, it might happen again. Y'all see the man every day. Seen him with I don't her? think one has no, anything to I'm do with the other. No, I'm just saying somebody see him with her in this group. I'm just saying. I hear what you all are saying, and I'm not trying to hide him from y'all. You got an opinion about what's going on with Michael and Ashley, me and Ray. Can I finish? But why is yours exclusive? You've been so guarded with us. Forever. And when I was guarded with you, I was rightfully so guarded with you. Would you tell Satan all your business? No. I'm just saying. So Wendy, I, not, I, I, you are I, Satan. I, I, uh, Karen, you, you're, you talk out the side of your neck. You immediately want to call Giselle a devil because I ask questions about things that are in the Washington Post. I'm going to allow you to read everything that's on the back of my shirt. Free Karen. Hey, Uncle Ben, tax reform. Oh. But I think the thing that I'm saying that you need to change, Giselle, yeah. 
is either you open up to this friendship circle and give what it is you demand of us, hey. or you need to keep your mouth quiet and stop being so nosy. Is that and your mom? Is that your mom? Is that your mom? What you doing? Yeah. That ain't, that's not going to satisfy me. I just want you to say hi to my friends. Hi. hi. There's Robin. Hi. <laughs> There's Karen. Hey, Jamal. <laughs> There's Ashley and Candace. All right, where are you now? Oh, on a train. On a train. All right. Giselle said, shut okay. the Right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Shut the the that was a good baby that step for me. Good baby step. I think you are failing us as a friend if you think that you're going to walk around and demand every morsel of our lives so you can judge and make jokes about it, but we can't have an opinion about yours. If you want to be superficial friends? We can do that dance, Giselle, because I'm not giving you shit because you don't give shit except shit. Now. Hold on. I've always known. I've been around that Jamal lives in your phone. I know that. He calls no, you all no, the time. He lives in my life. OK, but I'm saying, as far as conversation, he lives in your phone. I'm just yeah. saying I know he lives in the he phone. Does. He ain't here.